everyone welcome to my channel my name is jenny and you are in turkey headquarter so the latest now i just came here to update you guys um remember the last time i did video about the secret engagement of Kinomi being engaged like on her birthday and there have been a whole lot of reactions and so many people are saying that that the man that engaged Queen Naomi is no other person than Oni or Fifi. Like, they want to redo their wedding. Like, I was like, what is these people saying? So, before I give you guys details, let's just read this comment right here. So, this person said on that video that I posted, how can you be engaged to another man and spend the birthday with Oni? Hmm? And the next person said, Queen Nomi is going back to the Oni. And the last person said, she remarried to King. So stop worrying yourself. Hmm. They are all saying the same thing in different ways. So the first person is trying to say that, um, that Queen Nomi did not engage another man. That, like, that Queen Nomi was not engaged by another man. That it was only of you that engaged Queen Nomi. I was like... How can Oni of Ife engage Queen Nomi? How can? Like, even if they want to redo the wedding, engagement is not necessary. Yeah, it's not necessary. Then this person now said, Queen Nomi is going back to the Oni. Yeah, we've been hearing that since 2021, that Queen Nomi is going back to Oni of Ife. But... Queen Naomi is nowhere to be found in Oni of Ife's palace. In fact, he said Oni of Ife has married seven wives on top. Queen Naomi is not bothered about going back to the palace. What is bothering Queen Naomi right now, I think, is how to, you know, separate herself from the tradition that she got herself into by marrying Oni of Ife. And as I said before, Queen Nomi will never marry another man unless she is cleared by Oni of Ife, all those rituals that they did. Then another person here, before we continue, said that um, she remarried to kings. So stop worrying yourself. Oh, so Queen Nomi re remarried to Oni of Ife and... We didn't see picture of them getting married. We didn't see picture of anything. No, that this kind of thief, Queen Nomi, eventually remarried Oni or went back to the palace. That would be huge. They, they will announce it. Do you know why? Because Queen Nomi came to social media to write that she's no longer uh, the queen of Ileife, that she tried her best, blah, 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 all those stuff that she wrote on the 21st or 23rd of December, 2021. Yeah, so if at all we know me went back to Oni of Ife, there will be a big celebration because I believe that a lot of people in Ile Ife still want we know me back. But me, we know me going back to the palace right now is impossible. Do you know why? There are so many reasons. One, Oni of Ife already married seven wives on top. Anywaysha, um, I know a lot of people might not see it as anything, but I still feel that um, Queen Nomi already knew all these women that Oni of Ife married while she was at the palace, but they are not officially announced as Oni of Ife wife or married properly as Oni of Ife wives. But they are always at the palace. They have their own quarters. They have been with Oni of Ife for, for ages. The only difference is... Um, they were they did their wedding properly engagement party all those things and officially um and um they became Oni of Fife's wife so that the whole world will get to know about it are you telling me that when Kwenomi was at the palace and there is other women um or concubines of Oni of Fife that the public did not know about. So you want Kwinomi to go back right now that Oni of Ife has seven wives. No, it's impossible. As I'm talking to you, they said Kwinomi will soon get married. But the only thing I want to get is, has she done the tradition she did before? 
um some people are saying that she has done it secretly with her families and all of that some are saying that um she might be dating and she can date another man but she can't get married but traditionally it's according to yoruba culture if you get married to a king before you remarry another person you have to undergo some traditions especially um is a very strong title it's not something that she can walk out from and also quinomi has a son with oni of ife quinomi is the only person that gave birth to a son to oni of ife remember a few days ago um oni of ife's daughter sophie's 16 years old daughter so mind you oni of ife and olori um quinomi married only for three years and or let's say yeah three years and so that means Quinomi was aware that Oni of Ife has daughters. Yes, because Princess Adiola is there and this other second daughter that um, princess, another princess that did her birthday yesterday. So to tell you that some of the things that the social media are getting to know right now, Quinomi already knows all those things. You know, people are saying that Oni of Ife broke her heart, this married so many women. Quinomi is aware that only of if he has so other women even before only married her just that they were not officially announced they were not like um they they are not the yellow they are not the one just like let's assume um a president some nigeria like uh, obasanjo when obasanjo was president of nigeria obasanjo has like two or three wives or something like that but it's only one person that he used as the first um uh, first lady you will use two people as first lady. So in Quinomi's case was that other women are not, I, I don't know how I will classify them so that they won't be angry watching this video. But Quinomi was a woman that was properly married and welcomed into the palace. Remember only of if he is a king. They said someone can just come with his people and said, I want to marry the king. If only of if he accepts the person, the person will remain in the palace. The same when you go to palace of Ileife, you will see so many beautiful women that are only of if face wife. Yes. Remember last year, not last year, 2021 when I did video, um, because Jesus Lover posted it that other wives of Oni of Ife are protesting that they want the public to know them. They, do, they are tired of hiding. M most of them has children, but I think his female children is only Quinomi that gave birth to a son. And Quinomi is the youngest among them. Yes, that time. But right now, as Oni of Ife has married Oloritobi and the other lady that stays in the u.s that one is the youngest right now so what i'm trying to say is one only of if they did not celebrate quinomi's birthday they did not celebrate it together but i know that they said only of if he wished her happy birthday privately yes and secondly it's not only of if he that gave quinomi ring how can only of if he give quinomi ring when um i don't know i don't know how like they have no if um only of should give kinomi ring i did him boyfriend and girlfriend new boyfriend and girlfriend i don't understand they said that someone that is very much interested in marrying naomi marrying queen naomi today today maybe before the end of the year everything will bust either kinomi will get married or maybe January next year, but believe me, you, Quinomi is fighting to get married. And according to what I hear also, like Quinomi cannot marry anybody from Ileife because of Oni of Ife. Like if you are from Ileife, you cannot marry Quinomi because your king has already married her before. That is the tradition. The same thing happened to Alafin of Oyo's wife then. They said nobody from Oyo can marry them. They can marry outside um, Oyo state, but they can't marry anybody from Oyo. Yeah, you know. So I just want to update you guys and clarify this um, this comment. That was why I did this video. So 
Thank you so much for watching. If you have other things you want to see, you can just drop it on the comment section. Thank you so much and enjoy your weekend. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for your support. And if you watch up to this moment and you have not subscribed to my channel, che, subscribe now and click on that notification bell so you'll be getting notification anytime I post a new video. I love you guys so much and I appreciate all your love. Thank you. Bye-bye.